another episode of Rose and Gold, and I'm your host, Black King Sebastian, and this is my lovely co-host, Dr. Ross. Hello, everyone. As you guys know, tonight is the night for the Rose and Gold She's Hot Contest. Exactly. It's what you've all been waiting for. That's right, and you know it's sponsored none other than by the Playboy International. So, Dr. Ross, would you please unveil the winner? So, we're going to have a drum roll, please. And the winner of this week's She's Hot is Noah Cyrus, Miley Cyrus's younger, scandalous sister. She's just like Cardi B's younger sister, who was last week's She's Hot winner. Both scandalous, more scandalous than their sisters. probably adding them in for the publicity to get that sugar and spice in there. Exactly. All I'm going to say is this is probably just a random guy that they brought to the show and said, hey, we'll pay you a couple dollars to be on the show and give us a little bit more of a little bit spice to the show. That's true. Give us something that you can tease about your new Quibi show, and I want to know a little bit more about this twin brother. Um, yeah, so I discovered Kirby on Instagram, probably like most people. And um, he's amazing. He is my fraternal twin. And he just was, he struck me. He was so talented at actually like Photoshopping not only photos, but videos. And I thought he was really cool. And um, he was super funny. And not only me, but a lot of my friends and like fashion people and people that I worked with, they all started to like notice him. And I was like, oh my God, he's really like blowing up. And people would send me his stuff all the time. And I was like, this guy's amazing. So, you know. No, we had to do something with him, so. So Tyrese Gibson hangs out with Scotty Pimpin and his kids at the Gibby Hana restaurant. What do you think about this Black Kings fashion? First of all, Tyrese, you used to be a model. Now you're an actor and you're damn good at your singing. Exactly. So Tyrese, props to you because now you're a tycoon. You're a multi-millionaire. Going from saying the Coca-Cola commercials with your I-I-I Coca-Cola to being a multi-millionaire. So You've Tyrese, been a multi-millionaire, Tyrese, but props. that's right. That's right, Dr. Ross. So Tyrese, that's for you. Say hi to your wife for me. Moving on to our next hot topic. Esha Gupta. I don't know who this is, but apparently she has lost her cool when her fans 
compared her to the ultimate Hollywood diva. You all know her, Angelina Jolie. Apparently people were saying she is a diva and she looks similar to Angelina Jolie. From the pictures, I'm saying she sort of looks like Angelina Jolie, but Angelina Jolie is the 10 out of 10. I'm it's sorry really, to say it. Sorry to cut you off, Dr. Ross, but Continue. Angelina Jolie, she is the 10 out of 10. After looking at this, she's almost like a prototype exactly. of Angelina Jolie. Not to knock, because, you know, you still look hot if you're close to Angelina Jolie. Oh my God! Wow! Oh my God! Shia LaBeouf. So, quite a bit of topics has been going on with you. But recently, if you don't know, he was in the Transformers with Megan Fox. He recently started revealing that he was dating Megan Fox for a while during the Transformers movies um, because the, you know, the Machine Gun Kelly rumors are coming out and people think that they're dating. And he went out to say, I guess, I don't know why, I think he wants to brag that he also dated Megan Fox. What do you think about this black stash? Then again, to Shia LaBeouf, this is good and all, but then again, it's not that good since you know that Megan Fox is scandalous. Who knows? She was probably dating everyone at the Transformers exactly. set. Exactly. Because you know that she's out there being a scandal. Because Megan Fox, you could be the next winner. That's for you. But Megan Fox, we would love for you to be on the Rose and Gold show. We'd give you a fine interview. But what do you think about this, Dr. Ross? I'm going to agree with you there, Black King Sebastian, but this topic... Interesting enough, it just refreshed. It's saying that they were calling, people are basically calling her a stripper now. That is quite an interesting thing because actually, if you, you know the music video that we were talking about just yesterday, the Bloody Valentine, when you look at what people have to say, we'll put it up here, people were saying that, the, um, that this is a win for Machine Gun Kelly. Basically, his fans were saying that they finally got, they finally got Megan Fox on their side and Megan Fox is here to stay. First of all, the only thing about the fans, they're doing what they want to do. Exactly. Because fans will be fans. That's right. Because you know Machine Gun Kelly is probably dating the Megan Fox, like it's saying on the news. Because you know Megan Fox, she's going out there doing her thing. And she's trying to get away from the one husband right now. Because of their split. That's, That's right. That's a little far to call her a scripper. But let's get into Ask Dr. Ross. And before we do that, Dr. Ross, you could just tell that it's all the haters trying to go on it right now. Exactly. But let's get into Ask Dr. Ross. I'm not listening to you. You're crazy. Okay, our first question is from Billy. Billy is asking you, Dr. Ross, do you think Megan Fox is a real scripper or is she an actor? Well, first of all, thank you for the question, as always, Billy. And two, Megan Fox... All I want to say about this, this is kind of like how people say Kim Kardashian is not an actor or an actress, but Kim Kardashian says she's an actress. That is one or the other, but Megan Fox, these are two different things. You are not a stripper, not, not anywhere there. You probably have to get a little bit more practice, a little bit more stuff here and there, and you know, but you could come with Black King Sebastian on international playboy international and we could get you a poll and then you could be a stripper but for now as in real life and not playing around on people's music videos you're not a stripper that's right megan fox but as dr ross said come to playboy international call 1-800-BLACK-KING we'll hook you up moving on to our second and final question of the day yes sir this nigga spitting so this question is from jonathan jonathan is asking What's up, or what's the deal with Megan Fox and Machine Gun Kelly? So first of all, Machine Gun Kelly, get your look together before we even talk about anything. Get your look together. Your neck is a little bit too long. Your hair is fucked off. You were good in the one movie with um, the Blackbird. The Blackbird. You were good in that movie. They rigged you up. They made you look like you were something. And then it looks like your makeup people, whoever was putting you up, to rigging you up, just said. Uh, go do your own thing because you do look like you look like Justin Bieber. You look like you just came out of a fireplace like Scarecrow. Get your look together and then we can talk about this. And second, it seems like all the guys are going to be coming out 
it seems like Shia LaBeouf has came out and um, Machine Gun Kelly, all these people are coming out saying that they're dating Megan Fox. You already know tons and tons and tons of guys are going to be saying that Megan Fox was their side piece. But you can't hate the game. You can't hate the player. You got to just roll with it. That's right. And Dr. Ross, to add on to your question, or to add on to your answer, Go ahead. you know, if everyone's dating her, you could add my name into the list. Exactly. Black King. But these were all of our questions for Ask Dr. Ross and all of our hot topics for today. But make sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you can see when our new videos get uploaded. Exactly. And make sure to share this video with your friends and family so they can see the fun. But Kylie Jenner, that's sweet.